us off with our eye cam from Missoula earlier today. What a pretty scene this afternoon. Sun trying to peek through the clouds. Some of that fresh snow on the ground that we got over the weekend. Officially over the weekend in Missoula factoring Saturday into Sunday. We had about 2.1 inches fall with most of that Saturday night during the game as those snow bands set up leading to a uh, wintry and snowy game there as we know on uh, Saturday night. Now temperatures are warming up. We're talking 50s for highs in rain as we move into tomorrow. I'll show you that in a second. Here's a look at Polson this afternoon. Not much snow there again. They didn't see the snow band set up, so if you didn't fall under those bands Saturday night, not a lot of snow out there in Polson, but a pretty scene this afternoon and going up over Lookout Pass. They received some nice snow over the weekend, over a foot of snow. However, even the mountain passes we're talking about rain with a wet and mild system to start the week. Have an avalanche watch in place actually. So look here at the orange. This is where we have an avalanche watch through Tuesday. Mild temperatures, rain, snow, melting snow as well. All that uh, factor together could create some dangerous avalanche conditions in the backcountry. The further west is where the heaviest rain is going to be with an actual flood watch for parts of Idaho and Washington through Thursday. So an atmospheric river is still going on and this means means just a parade of storms moving through. So another one comes in on Tuesday. This one follows right behind it, bringing us some more showers as we go into Wednesday. Again, mostly rain with the warmer temperatures. So let's move in a little bit closer. The setup for this evening, northwest Montana could see a little rain, maybe some freezing rain into this evening as well. So if you're in the Flathead Valley, especially in the glacier region driving, be prepared for some chance of icy roads and some freezing rain as we go into this evening. Now tomorrow, here's the setup. This system, best chance for rain, Montana, Idaho border. Other areas just scattered showers, west, central, southwest Montana, we're dry tomorrow. Temperatures in the 50s out there, all right? Again, Tuesday afternoon, this is where our best chance of rain is, especially here along the Montana, Idaho border. Better chance for a few more widespread showers in as we go into Wednesday afternoon. So how much rain are we talking about? Well, let's let this run through Tuesday and we stop this on Wednesday. Notice most of the rain northwest Montana where we're drier west central southwest Montana, especially as you can see along the Montana Idaho border there. Then we run this into Thursday light rain the further south you go. So we're expecting a little more rain with this system as you can see for areas across the northwest part of the state. But again, snow not much. This is snow through Thursday. So even the mountains and mountain passes you're going to generally see a lot of this fall as rain. All right, tonight our lows are going to be down mostly into the 30s and the 40s showers across northwest Montana, drier west central southwest Montana. Look at the temperatures tomorrow. Well into the 40s, even 50s out there. Rain the further north you go and we'll be drier with sunshine and 50s for areas in west central southwest Montana. Missoula 51 Tuesday, 49 Wednesday, slowly cooling it down then as we end the week. Kalispell, few rain showers Tuesday, Wednesday, maybe some snow starting to mix in by Thursday and Friday. Hamilton 52 Tuesday, 50 Wednesday, 40s Thursday, 34 by Friday.